10 Weird Wearable Gadgets That Will Change Your Life in 2018 Las Vegas, wearable devices are finally growing more sophisticated than the dime a dozen fitness trackers we've seen in the last few years. Sensors are becoming more capable each year, and now we're seeing gadgets that are essentially wearable medical devices. Fitness tracking has moved from the wrist to the rest of the body, with smart shoes, clothing and glasses that analyze your workouts. We saw a slew of cutting-edge wearables at seas. Here are 10 that could make a huge difference in your life this year. Credit, Tom's Guide Omron's new device looks like a running watch, with its round display and thick black band, but this fitness tracker is actually a blood pressure monitor that lets you subtly take readings without anyone knowing. I tried on the smartwatch, which tracks steps taken, calories burned and distance traveled, and activated a blood pressure reading to see if it felt the same as having my blood pressure taken with a cuff in a doctor's office. Just as the nurse's cuff tightens around your upper arm as it measures your blood pressure, the watch tightens around your wrist as it takes a reading. Heart Guide also measures your blood pressure while you sleep, which the company says gives you a more complete data set to give to your doctor. Omron is waiting on FDA approval for the device, so pricing and availability information aren't yet available. Credit, Tom's Guide Willow is a wire-free breast pump that finally allows new moms to pump for their babies without anyone knowing. Because Willow doesn't need to be plugged into a wall, moms can move around and pump into self-contained, leak-proof milk bags that hold 4 ounces apiece. With two Willow pumps, moms can pump 8 ounces of milk at a time. The Willow app tracks how much milk a mom produces in real time, so she knows how much she has on hand for her baby at any given moment. The pumps are pricey at $479 a pop. For some women, though, the convenience might be worth the high cost. I spoke to a real Willow user, who also happens to be a nurse, whom the company brought to its seas booth. She told me that she was pumping while we spoke. I had no clue until she mentioned it. Talk about innovation. Credit, Tom's Guide Garmin makes some of the most popular fitness trackers for runners, but the company has never before offered a device with onboard music storage. That changed at seas, when Garmin unveiled its new $450 for runner 645 music, which allows you to store playlists offline to listen to while you run. I got the chance to run with the new 4Runner, and I can attest that the new feature makes a huge difference. No longer do runners have to bring along a smartphone to listen to their motivational playlists. The Garmin device is a little more expensive than its competitors, the Apple Watch Series 3 and Fitbit Ionic, but the 4Runner 645 Music offers more workout tracking options than those devices do. Credit, Tom's Guide Spire's first wearable was a mindfulness stone which you clipped inside your pants or bra to track your breathing and help you be more aware of your stress levels. The company's newest device is more versatile. Spire Health Tags are adhesive-backed wearables that you stick inside your underwear or bra to track vitals such as your heart rate, heart rate variability and breathing. The tags still focus on mindfulness, first and foremost, but are also more accurate for tracking your activity. Spire eventually wants to be able to use health tags to diagnose sleep apnea and alert users who show symptoms of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD. Health tags are an option for people who work or play in fields where they can't wear fitness trackers on their wrists. One device costs $49, or, you can buy a pack of 8 for $199, or 15 for $299. They're available now. Credit. Tom's Guide Serious Cyclists already use a variety of methods to stay safe on the road, but Coors wants to simplify those efforts with one solution, the Omni Smart Bike Helmet. The Omni's biggest selling point is its open bone induction audio, which lets you make calls and listen to music while still being able to hear everything that's around you, including cars and other cyclists. The helmet also features a crash sensor which alerts an emergency contact on your smartphone with a map of your location if you sustain an impact force of 1G or greater. The helmet even sports light strips on the back to make you more visible when it's dark. Coras will be available later this winter for $200. Credit. 
Tom's guide L'Oreal's sun safety wearable looks more like decorative nail art than it does a tech gadget. The beauty company created an adhesive-backed electronic UV sensor that you can stick to your thumbnail, in order to measure the amount of UVA and UVB rays to which you're exposed. Most people know when they've been out in the sun for too long, but L'Oreal's UV sense gadget detects the invisible rays that can cause cancer and premature signs of aging, even when it's cloudy outside. The sensor will stick to your thumbnail for up to two weeks before needing more adhesive, and can store up to three months of data. An NFC chip pairs the sensor to your smartphone, where the two gadgets can sync and analyze the data. L'Oreal has not yet announced pricing and availability. Credit, Tom's Guide Solos is bringing a Google Glass style display to a pair of sunglasses to give you more data about your running and cycling workouts. The Solos smart glasses sport an augmented reality display above your right eye which shows you exercise stats from your smartphone. The glasses don't actually track anything on their own, but they make it easier to view the information from your phone. Internal speakers read out your distance, speed and other stats if you prefer to hear them rather than view them. Solos has made a comfortable pair of specs that, miraculously, don't look terrible. They resemble a pair of sporty sunglasses. I can imagine that trying to focus on a small display inside your glasses would be uncomfortable for runners and cyclists. But Solos representatives at Seas told me that you stop noticing it after a while. We'll have to put that to the test when the $499 smart glasses debut this spring. 